Welcome everybody to well, the finale video of Confirmed Games of 2015. Twelve games have been confirmed right now. We have Mario's Missing, game number one that got confirmed. Sanctuary Hedgehog 3 is game number two. The Legend of Zelda Minish Cap, or The Minish Cap is the game like preferred, is confirmed game number three. Final Fight, confirmed game number 4. Wario Land, Super Mario 3, confirmed game number 5. Final Fantasy 7, confirmed game number 6. Mortal Kombat, will be number, Mortal Kombat 2, confirmed as the 7th game. Battletoads, confirmed as game 8, is probably the one I'm going to be going to uh, not look forward to the most. Chrono Trigger, or that will be the ninth game, by the way. Chrono Trigger, the tenth, Mega Man X3, the eleventh, and joining all them, DuckTales. It's the final game, as it actually dominated most of the voting, with Darkwing Duck not receiving, receiving two of the votes. Among other games that got votes throughout the tournament, Earthworm Jim, Mega Man Zero. I think Tomb Raider received a vote. Uh, not a whole lot on that entire right side, actually. Uh, Luigi's Mansion. There are the only three games that received votes. Uh, the, actually, the games that did not get votes in that fourth row there, going vertical, the ones that are actually still in white, not one of them received votes. In fact, one person commented against Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask when I d didn't even bring in the twist. So, now with that being said, will some of these other games get Let's Play that are on this list? Possibly. Is it guaranteed? No. It all depends on any, what the progress is. Now, when it comes to Chrono Trigger itself, I don't know what version I'll be doing as of yet. I got it written down as the Super Nintendo version, and I might stick with that. But, again, I'm not 100% sure. I do own it on the original PlayStation. However, I've heard stuff saying that, well, it's slower, but yes, it's because of loading times. The DS version is also out, and if Bragg can get that capture card up and running, it's a possibility that I could LP that version. As for Sonic the Hedgehog 3, there was another option that I could have done there. What I'll be doing with that one, and I've said it within the videos, or I'll be seeing it within the videos rather, is I'm going to let's play the original Sonic the Hedgehog 3 first. If I get time, I'll let's play Sonic the Hedgehog 3 in Knuckles. If not, then that will be Let's Play in 2016, but yes, I will be doing the that those versions as well. As for other games this, on this list, some of the bigger ones that could take a longer time that are not confirmed, you might not see. I mean, for example, Wind Waker or Majora's Mask, you might not see them. It all depends on my progress in the original ones. But games such as Toe Jam and Earl, Panic and Funk Town, or James Pond Underwater Agent, something like them you could see. Even Sonic the Sega All Stars Racing, or The Conduit. Even Tasmania. Could see them once. Mega Man Zero is another possibility, and Earthworm Jim. You could see them, depending on situations. But the 12 games there that you see in green are 100% confirmed. They will be Let's Played. Even though I'm not looking forward to Battletoads personally, because I know how hard it is. Uh, Blood Spinning Lizard, I've seen his Let's Play of it. Not to mention, Nufi Banger has Let's Played the game. That's not going to stop me from Let's Playing it. Just, my approach to Let's Playing it might be a little different from normal. I'd have to wait and see in that one, and see what I could do with it. But as for 
what I've got done so far, Mario is missing and Sonic the Hedgehog 3, as of this video, are 100% recorded. I've actually started Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap recording now, but as of this recording, i got one video done. So, I'll be starting off the year with The Minish Cap. That'll be the first one to debut as of New Year's Day. Mario is mi missing, will result on the second. And then when that one's done, Sonic the Hedgehog 3 will take over at that place, and so forth and so forth. When it comes to the game Mortal Kombat 2, I also ha have plans on doing... I won't be doing all the character runs. I'm going to max it out at possibly three, four tops. Liu Kang is the one I will be doing last, as if you followed storylines on it, you know that that game itself, he was the champion at the end of it, too. So, spoiler alert if you never heard of it. When it comes to DuckTales, as far as my knowledge, I'll try the NES version, but I could do a HD remake. Again, it all depends. So, that's pretty well it. Don't expect me to 100% all of these uh, games here. It all depends on some of my progress. But, again, it all depends on some time restraints. So, this is Cole signing off. Peace out, everybody.